hello lovelies. One of the most requested things that I get are paper walkthroughs and I can't do paper walkthroughs with example papers because that infringes copyright but paper walkthroughs are really really useful. Now we got asked this a lot last year but this is the first year that we are actually doing it. We are doing, yes Prim, you ready for the big announcement? We are doing walkthroughs for all of our predicted papers. So that's GCSE, science, maths, A-level science and maths as well. So right, you get it done. Come here. Okay. Um, so what we are doing in these papers is we are showing you the question, so you don't have to get the PDF copy if you don't want to. You can see the question on screen and then we're going to pause it. We're going to break down the words in the question. So is this sentence in the question giving you a clue as to what the examiners are looking for? Because so many times it is. For example, if you see a question asking you for the mean, there's a clue that the examiners are asking you to look for an anomalous result. And unless you've been told that, it's really, really hard to know. So we're breaking down any clues in the wording, we're breaking down what the command words mean, so how to answer, describe and evaluate and an explain question. We're breaking down, you know, can you use bullet points or does this have to be in sentences? How can you tell from a question? How can you tell from the number of marks? whether that is okay or not okay. How can you tell from the number of marks what sort of structure you should have for your answer? You know, can it be a single word or can it be a much longer structure? Um, so we're doing all of the exam skills. Obviously we're doing all the science behind it. So the science you need to specifically answer that question, but then we're expanding on it as well. So we're explaining absolutely everything you need to know about this topic. So if we've written a four mark question, a six mark question comes up, we are still equipping you with the knowledge to have a go at that question. And then we're taking you through the mark scheme because the mark scheme, especially for some of the A-level maths papers, especially for some of the, the longer wordy ones, can be quite complicated to understand. So actually, what sort of things would you be getting marks for? What sort of things in here are exactly the sort of things that the examiners are looking for to pick you up on marks? So I have done all of the chemistry and the physics for GCSE. Um, Dr. Edwards has done all of the biology, GCSE and A-level. And then Charlotte, who is absolutely brilliant at this, she has done all of the GCSE, A-level maths and A-level chemistry. So three of us that have been working incredibly hard to get all of these done for you. And they're all available on the membership side of the channel. Now, you do have to pay for these. Um, and I know some people are going to disagree with that, but it was an extremely large amount of work to get all of this done, planned, checked, sorted out for you. So we do have to charge for this. All of the links are in the description down below. There's a monthly charge for this, but you can just have it for one month and then cancel. Um, or you can just do it the day before your exams, whatever suits you best. Um, but these are so, so good. It is like definitely, definitely worth the money. Ouch! This is why in some videos I have unexplained scratches. 